Welcome into the latest edition of Extra Time. Drama here once again. It's like Extra Time yesterday as well. We have the Australia <laughs> game going on. You can turn over your phone. Why are you scared yeah, to turn it over? What's wrong? I'm going to look at it the whole time. Okay. Uh, how, how long to go in the France game? Uh, four minutes. Four say. minutes. All right then. Okay. Any incident ever made you want to walk up? Oh, hello, boys. Uh, oh, Dan. Oh, Dan. <laughs> Thanks, Dan. Yeah, what are we chopped liver or what? <laughs> oh, hi, Kate. How are you? Oh, oh, you know. Any incident ever make you want to walk off the pitch? No, no, absolutely not. No, oh, it gets your blood going, doesn't it? It gets you fired up. Oh, well, exactly. <laughs> Look, that's what you play for. Absolutely. What about yeah. on the sidelines, did ever, ever you just want to go? Oh God, this is terrible. I want to go over. Ah, no, that's a little different. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We've had a few instances together yeah, on the side. Yeah. Like, I'm a skipper. We did that. Uh, <laughs> uh, Kate, anything? These guys are the best married couple ever, by the <laughs> oh, way. I just hilarious. <laughs> <That'd be awesome. laughs> it's been so fun. <laughs> what? Anything ever make you want to walk off the pitch? Uh, no, no, never. I'm like these That's guys. Oh, yeah. A, yeah. I've got to tell Love you. It. We're, oh, right. oh. we're playing Birmingham City at St Andrews, and there's a, a, a midfield player called Kevin Broadbent. Remember him or not? No. Remember the name. Right. It was a little bit of a. You know, I'm an egger. There you go. I, I'm glad you said it. And he's come into me really late, very high. So he's done me over the top of my knee, right in my thigh, and going into you know my uh, private areas. <laughs> so I jumped up immediately. Yes. I stuck the nut right on him. Right. Busted his nose. Okay. And walked straight off the field. You didn't have to turn around, and see didn't the red even, car. Didn't even bother. <laughs> now, have you ever had a conversation with him since? Never. Never. He's on your list of enemies. Yes, he is. Mr. Broadbent. <laughs> <laughs> Could Steve Nichol return to management again? Ooh. The dream team. Hey, you never say never. Would you ever consider it? No, mate. What do you miss about it the most? Not a lot. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Compared to this, you yeah. can. Yeah. <laughs> uh, co coaching's, coaching's great when the final whistle's gone and you've won the game. Right. Coaching is a disaster. When the final whistle goes, you've lost the game. I mean, it's just, it, it, there's no, there's no grey area whatsoever. And you know what I, I, I liked about it when I'm working with him? It's the way that he handled the dressing room. Because we hear so many players nowadays that are there, you know, Neymar wants him in and he, Mbappe wants him in. There was yeah. none of that. There was the hierarchy. Stevie sorted the hierarchy. Well, the refs were good when you were there. <laughs> well, Aye, we were. And, and then it fell apart. <laughs> <laughs> but but it, it was interesting how we did uh, it, you know what I mean? But then you went solo, didn't you? Aye, well, we had a massive conversations prior to that. Yeah, about... well, I'm not saying it was like an acrimonious... No, 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 we, we had <laughs> opportunities like a... to go elsewhere. All right, I wanted, still justified. <laughs> I wanted to, he didn't. He wanted to stay at home, didn't you, mate? I did, I. <laughs> just, just want to be friends. I did, you stay with the grandkids. <laughs> just want to be friends. Yeah. What were your favourite cleats to wear as a player? Did you have a favourite pair? Ooh, the um, Copas. I was an Adidas girl. Oh, yeah. I still am Adidas, yeah. I'm yeah, all about Copa. Thing. I don't like any of the fancy stuff. I like the old what school, color? real leather. Did you have a the black, the black and white one. Black and white? The original. Yeah. Right, but the real leather kind. You have to real make sure you get the real ones. Boys? Look at these guys. Um, well, they're not. We just sort of who. We just <laughs> having, hey, here's having a tea over we're there. We sort of who <laughs> was paying him and which boots he was wearing. Oh, oh yeah, I've heard the story about this. <laughs> I, I did oh, the same yeah. as well. Right. Well, least, I, I wear Puma, Puma Kings. They were my favourite ones. Right. The gold, the, the, the Adidas ones, mm -hmm. they were fantastic. I told you the other day, what was the name of the book? High Tech. High Tech, high tech yeah. yeah. So got high these, Tech? So the, the first High Tech book that came out was absolutely rotten. Right. I mean, you talk about <laughs> killing your feet. Yeah. I mean, they were made of concrete. So what, every, <laughs> what I used to do was I used to get Puma Kings, take the stripes off the Puma Kings, and put the stripes from the High Tech on the Puma Kings and wear them. Perfect. But unfortunately, ah, a lot go. of players were doing similar things with different makes of boots. Yeah. And then obviously High Tech were paying you to... High Tech were paying me to wear hey, them. Yeah. Is that... So what happened was, in, in the back pages of the News of the World one day, right. there was a player sliding in who had Puma King boots on, but the sole was Adidas. Uh... And so straight away, everybody... So, yeah. then, so then, the, then all the phone calls started going, right. Yeah. I don't know whether you are, yeah. but don't. That's what, that was the, that's what <laughs> that was the end like of back in the day. <laughs> that was the end of that. I had to put the concrete ones back um, on. Was it Craig Johnson? Yes. What was the one that he made? Out? Was it Predator? What? Predator. Predator, because he made them out of tyres, wasn't yes. it? Did you ever wear those? No. No. <laughs> you can't really see Steve as a Predator, can you? <laughs> no. Paul? 
Uh, and it is 2000s. In the way, way dark ages of football, there was a boot called the 2000s. Really? I, I did it. Unbelievable. Were they yeah. futuristic at the time? No. They were, they were what very made thick. them so good? The, just the leather. Did you sharpen the old... Uh... Yeah, the uh, aluminium studs, absolutely, yeah. yes. Uh, and then the Cobra Mundials for, uh, for the pre-season. Fantastic. The... <laughs> oh. Was it with the leather or with your kangaroo, yeah, you had kangaroo to, skin? You had to order the special leather ones because they tried to send you the fake ones. The dope ones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So you had to know the SKU number to make mm. sure you got the right one. See, I take, I take, you used to use kangaroo skin. It was fantastic. Wow. Mm -hmm. Kangaroo is so comfortable. So you could jump it's high. perfect. Bubble. Oh, oh, what? Oh. <laughs> hey, he's here all week. <laughs> what? Right. <laughs> right over my head. Is that a dad joke? That went right over my head. Of course it is. Uh, <laughs> next question, best jelly for a PBJ? Oh my God. Grape. Right? Welsh's grape jelly. I don't even think there's any fruit in it, but it's so good. Well, it's, it might be all chemicals, it's but it's sugar. tasty. Yeah. Yes. Where do you stand on a PBJ? What? <laughs> I've never had it. <laughs> Peanut butter and jelly. You've cool. never had it? Never had it. No. Why not? What's the problem? Because it looks peanut rotten. Hmm? It looks rotten. Do you, like, do you like peanut butter? No. Oh, well, that's worse. Do you? That's I've never had it. Do you? See, jelly's, jelly's different from... It's jam for us, see? Thanks, Paul. Yeah. <laughs> Jelly's different. <laughs> yeah. I like jam. Well, jelly's the same. No, it's not. No, it's, it's not. not. No, it's, it's not. not. Shit, it's don't you start. What are you talking about? It's You've just not. been killing me all Jelly is statement. like preservative. You're from like Cornwall. Are you telling me you don't know the difference between jam and jelly? It's pretty much the same. It's Shut not. up. We know this is stupid. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Honestly, it's absolutely nothing like each other. Jam and jelly. Well, like the same difference. Yeah. Honestly. Rubbish. It tastes good on toast. Talking a bit. Can we trade in Sevi and give Kate a permanent spot on the show? Oh, Aye, oh absolutely. Why not? Absolutely. Is it is there somewhere we can vote, or is it like a <laughs> is there a box we can put a wee note in for, to somebody? Suggestion. No. Suggestion box. Sebastian. Yeah, uh, no, he's on to see on the uh, pods, which which will be talking Almost. about Almost one France minute. Against Brazil. One more minute. Still two one. Two one France. Extra time. Wow. That's it. That'll be it. The US obviously in action tomorrow. Be sure to uh, listen to Kate's pod ahead of that. And then join us tomorrow when we'll be looking back at that game. Plus, there's just lots of football going on everywhere. But be sure to join us as we'll keep you up to date with everything.